Hi guys, good morning. Um, probably can hear the traffic outside. Living on a main road is like. Today is the first day of my mock exam week. I thought I'd film it because I did it last time. I'll give you guys a story for what happened this morning. I get up at 7 a.m. Um, I pre-fledged and then I go and check my exam timetable just to know the room I'm gonna be in. And then my exam timetable said that my ex I thought my exam was at 9 a.m. That's why I got up early. Otherwise, I would have just prayed and went back to sleep with help. I went, I got up and it said my exam was at 1 p.m., not 9 a.m. So I was like, safe, good night. I went back to sleep, woke up at 10 a.m., great three hours of sleep. And now I'm now going to school. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know how long it's going to take me to get to college. I don't want to revise FM1 again because I've revised it so many times. So I think I deserve the rest. So I went back to sleep. And it was a great lovely sleep that I don't regret whatsoever. I'll date you guys in the test after I've done it. Oh, I might revise before. I might just do some chemistry before because I've done for FM1 now. I'm actually sick of it. So I'll just do chemistry instead if I have time. If not, then no, but yeah. I finished my further mechanics paper. The questions were not easy at all. But like I answered every single one of them, even the part B's. I answered everything. I could. I literally tried. <sighs> Prediction. I'd say I get like eighty percent. Um, like I, I don't know, but um, it was a solid paper. To be honest, it, I'm not concerned about FM one. I'm concerned about core. Core maths is solid. I need to revise chemistry because I've got chemistry test on Wednesday. Hi guys, um, I unexpectedly treated someone today. I really completely forgot I had a lesson. I was supposed to sit down and revise chemistry, but I completely forgot that I was supposed to treat someone today. So I treated someone. Um, it was a really nice lesson. I should enjoy it. But I should revise now. Um, probably do it off camera because um, maybe do a little bit on camera. I'm going to go through a bunch of chemistry booklets, just like blurt stuff out. I'm not really like going to do any exam questions today because I can't be bothered. It's probably going to be half... I don't know how many I can get through today, but it shouldn't take me that long to get through at least most of them. And then tomorrow will be days of like going through definitions. I can go through definitions today. I only need, I've done all the definitions, all the definition I've forgotten. The only is module five. And then um, everything else, I know it. Like, I don't feel confident about chemistry for some reason, but like, I know I can do okay. Like, it's okay. Like, I'm not going to stress um, because there's no point. Today's January the 10th. Tomorrow's the 11th. I'm not in college. Uh, I've got no exams tomorrow. Tomorrow's uh, tomorrow's a day uh, of studying and just long. And then um, the 12th, uh, I've got a chemistry exam at 1 p.m. And then Thursday, I'm off. And that's going to be spent revising core maths and probably editing a video. And then Friday morning, 9 till 10.30, I've got a core exam. So I'll plan out how much I can split between both subjects um and i'll try my best yeah i had a really good shawarma today like i'm not lying this shawarma was really good and um i'm a happy person when i eat a good shawarma and um yeah <laughs> So I didn't film yesterday because I was quite tired and the whole day was just incredibly overwhelming. Um, yesterday was Wednesday the 12th of January and I had a 2 hour and 15 minute chemistry exam. Alhamdulillah it was not difficult, um, it was quite straightforward. Like, I'm glad that I didn't find it difficult. It was just really long, like it really got like to the point where I was just like when's this test gonna finish the test was really thick as well like it was so long i was just like what the hell but apparently that's how long a level chemistry <sighs> I
I'm going to go to David Lloyd's now. I'm going to revise for the call. And um, I don't know if I feel like exercising because I don't. I'm probably just going to revise in the cafe. And yeah. So um, I have my iBeds here. And I'm on good notes. And I'm basically just doing like so core papers. I managed to do two today. Uh, I'm on my third one now. Uh, and then I'm gonna do this one and another one, and then I should be done. Basically, what they're doing, I can't do every single question in the core paper. My teachers, what they're doing, if they've taken out the questions and the topics that are not gonna be on the test. So, um, is I get through about like five questions a paper uh, because my teachers have taken some of them out. I don't think I'm doing like eight hours of revision. I'm, I'm not, I promise you. I'm not doing an unhealthy amount. I wanna do these questions. There's about like six questions to go. Uh, six to seven, I think should be fine. Uh, and then I want to go over vectors and matrices just like um, quickly. I need to memorize how to invert a three by three matrix. Um, I know how to do it. I just need to go through the method. Um, and then I also want to um, go through a bit of uh, just a bit of methods with vectors just to make sure that I don't forget some of them. Uh, and I will be fine. Now, I'm not going to stress. Um, and then look at a bunch of modeling. But um, yeah, calculus I'm fine, um, functions, hyperbolics and polar I'm okay with, and um, calculus of inverse trig is fine, <coughs> complex numbers and polynomials are fine, um, I'm actually fine, I'm not going to stress, um, so yeah, hopefully tomorrow's going to be a good day. And then um, I have a master, I've got like a mini kind of chemistry lesson I want to prep for. I've got another video to edit. And then I've also got, um, yeah, that's not today. I'm going to do that tomorrow after I finish my exams. I'm be a bit busy tomorrow, so I'm just clean the house well. And um, just get my life a bit planned. I'm going to make a plan of action. Uh, I've got a plan of action for 2022, but I need to do some, a bit of journaling and just like a 22 plan. 2020, I've got a bit, I've started it, but I haven't finished it. So I'm going to do that as well. And um, yeah. I did. I very I much underestimated how spicy these noodles were. I promise you guys, I'm gonna get my water. This is very spicy. Okay, I probably should have put half the packet in. Okay. I promise you guys I don't eat noodles every single day. I just film them because they look pretty when I eat them. But I don't eat them every single day. I promise. I eat them frequently, but not every day. They're really good. They're very spicy. This is the two times spicy. That's why I'm really struggling right now. Because if it's the normal one, I can down it. It's not that deep. This one is really spicy. Today is my further master's. Oh, there's a bus coming. It was bus basically, I ran to the bus stop. I hate running to the bus stop because it makes me look like such an idiot. Then when I went to the bus stop and the bus driver couldn't be bothered to wait 10 seconds just so I get like, I don't even tell like five seconds. He just drives off. Anyway, it's fine. I think there's a bus here. Oh, and it's empty as well. I love empty buses. I want to empty bus. I'm going to empty bus. See you guys. Yeah, I'm going to get to Twitter. I'm going to get to Twitter finally finished my marks so i didn't film anything in college because uh, you know, I, just, I had an exam and it was an hour and a half and just got off so it was further pure yeah I, the thing is yeah the test was not hard but i couldn't answer it like i the thing is the questions themselves weren't really difficult but i didn't really know some of the steps to answer some of them like the vectors one was weird the matrices simultaneous square one was weird and then one of the hyperbolic ones was like, prove this formula is that I was just like, I, what? Uh, I, got, I started it and then I kind of, the time was finishing and I had other things to finish off. And as, a, as the test overall, I wasn't the happiest with how I performed compared to the FM1. I think I performed way better in FM1. What it is, uh, I'm really glad that these mocks are over, but let me tell you guys, start time. So basically in the exam, we have a maths formula booklet and a further maths formula booklet. And one of the pages, or two of the pages in the further maths formula booklet were missing. 
um it wasn't really that deep i like we managed to work with our they originally not everyone's working it's fine i was like miss there are two pages missing i don't care like to going back and forth with her i finally got the um formula booklet thing started so they went and got us formula booklets and um i didn't really need the formula booklet but um we, it was just missing so we might as well have had it um so i felt a bit bad but then they went inside out and realized that it was a mistake on their behalf like oh attention everyone um you've been given family booklets blah 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 um don't write on them this this and that and then they were like um and then she was like oh um and b due to the mess of the um and because of the mess of the family booklets um they gave us 10 minutes of extra time so thanks to me everyone got 10 minutes of extra time which i'm not gonna lie to you i needed but i lied to you my timing with this test wasn't great the thing is yeah some of the topics in further maths the timing is so annoying like I, the thing is my timing in general is quite good but with further maths some of the topics take a the process is really tedious like for example roots of polynomials with like quartics and cubics it gets so tedious it takes too long to do and it's not even difficult sometimes it takes so long to do certain things and it consumes a lot of time especially like just constantly like expanding stuff for ages the trains that pass by my house i've never seen that before because you learn something new every day i need to edit a bunch of videos um prepare for tutoring and yeah today is saturday the 15th of january and um i've been tutoring pretty much all day i did two sessions today i am basically just managing bookings and starting my calendar out just organizing myself Jan january seems to be a bit of a busy month so yeah i basically um just got a bunch of stuff to prep but i've got a session tomorrow and then my birthday's on monday and uh i might in the weekends i might take a break from tutoring i don't know I don't know what I want to do for my birthday yet, but yeah. Uh, basically, my plan is I need to get a bunch of planners out and um, make a list. I can't find my to do list, but I need to make a list of basically what I need to revise. The link to these will be in my description box down below. Uh, I need to just make a list of things I need to revise for each subject and hang it on my wall. So I will do that now. Um, it's just to be honest, I think the main focus is maths A level. Um, and then some of the topics in my that were not in my chemistry mark, so um, which is only one topic really, so it's not even that deep. And just get organized, and then um, put some, and also probably um, sort out my notion to do this. So also it's kind of set my twenty twenty with two goals. I've kind of said I was going to do this, so I'll get my iPad and do that. Uh, that is on notion here, and if you want a nice, this template is actually from on Jade Jade um it's in the link of one of her videos i can't remember which one it was but i linked that in the description box i will do that um yeah so i will do that but i need to go through this first and then do everything else i want to plan my week because i need to fast as well this week my light needs to come this way there we go so yeah so i'm gonna do one thing at a time and yeah <laughs> 